It's Rokaz, your digital lifestyle expert here, and I'm going to show you how to set the alarm on your iPod. Now, for this demonstration, just so you know, I'm going to be using a sixth generation iPod. It also works on the fifth and fourth, so follow along. First thing we want to do is continue to hit your menu button until you're all the way back to your main screen. Okay? Now you're going to see, you'll know you're there because it'll be your major designations. First of all, well, once you hit menu, you're not going to go back any further. But you'll see music, videos, photos, podcasts. What we're looking for is extras. So hit the center button and we're in extras. Move it up to, or down rather, to alarms. And there, you can create an alarm or a sleep timer. We're going to create a new alarm right here. We're going to turn it on. We can set the date. Well, let's go ahead and set the date here. All right, we're going to make it today. And toggling through, it's going to be this year. We're going to set the time that we want it to. We're just going to hit the center button, and we're just going to move the wheel. As I move the wheel, you're going to see the number change, and you're going to see it move on the real clock. So let's set it at, uh, let's see here, 4 o'clock. By hitting the center button, I'm moving it over. And let's set it to 421. Click there. We do want it to be PM and click it over. Now we can choose to repeat it. We want to do that every day, just on the weekends, weekdays, every week, every month, every year. You decide. We're going to leave it on once here. When we put it down to the sound, aha, the fun part about the sound is you can do a tone just like a beep. Oh, is that fun? Nah. We go down to our playlists here and now we can decide to put on some real fun songs. So instead of just having beep, 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 you know, you want uh, BC Boys Fight for Your Right to Party, well, <laughs> you just decide. Uh, that's the thing about the iPod. Now we can go down to Label here, and if you have a bunch of different ones, you can choose it. Is that alarm, let's see here, yeah. I'm going to use that alarm to remind me to take my medication. And then if we want to make it go away, we could just simply hit Delete. So remember, it's as easy as going menu all the way back, extra, alarms, and then just go down this thing and set the different things that you want. How long you want it to be, what time, what date, what you want to call it, what should it play, you decide. The iPod puts you in control. Like me, Rokaz, your digital lifestyle expert, saying, stream you later. Stream you later.